Hey guys, um, Ruben here, and I've got a book today. Guess what? It's a review. And I was thinking about making this a series, as in every Wednesday I would come and review a book, and I'm going to call it Review Wednesdays, or Review Wednesdays. Either way works. Um, what I was thinking about doing is, since the library is open now, I can get more books. I wanted to do a series of books. Um, something that I haven't read so that every week I can read it and then give it to you guys fresh, instead of going to, like, Cirque du Freak and giving it to you guys, because I've read it a couple times now, even the entire series. So, I read it from the flight here, and I thought it was a pretty good book. My teacher let me have it from last year. The author is Terry Truman. I'm actually doing a piece for speech and debate by this guy that I just noticed right now. <laughs> Did not know that. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And I was just thinking, yeah, maybe I can do a review Wednesdays and then maybe upload a vlog or something or bloopers or something on Fridays. You know, you guys might like that. I don't know. Um, yeah, let's get into the book. I like, I like this book because it's different. It's different from most other ones. I find myself laughing at points where I believe I shouldn't laugh, but the humor is so dry and so cut, it's, uh, it's hilarious. There's this one passage where Zack is the main character, and he has schizophrenia, and they're, they're pointing a gun at him, and he's like, oh, okay, yeah, no, you're not real, no, mm -mm, you're not real. And I can't help but laugh at that. He gives a new meaning to the name Wastoid. If you read the book, you'll know what I mean. Um, the first thing that I notice about this book is how dry it is. Dry as in a good thing in this book. It really works for it. It's slightly dry humor, but a lot of action. And it's, it's pretty good. Um, I might add that I read this book a couple of times just because I like the idea of the book. And I like the way it was structured. I like the sentence structure. I like the chapters. Gives you little insides into, into Zack and about how he's feeling, kind of. He can't tell reality from 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 make-believe. It's, it's really intriguing. And I, I don't know what else to say, because it was really good. There was literally nothing wrong with this book. Other than the fact it's a little too short. That's about it. That's my biggest my biggest complaint. That it's too short. And from now on I think Terry Truman's gonna be one of my authors to watch. Besides um, Darren Shan, which I like a lot of his books. And there's there's some books that I, I prefer reading over others, like fiction. I prefer fiction over anything. Some documentaries, some biographies. Documentaries, don't quote me on that. Um and yeah. So, why not go out, see if your your library at school, or your library anywhere, or it's an audiobook or an ebook, find it, read this book. It's it's really good. I recommend it. I recommend this book. And if you ever thought that living the way you live is difficult, you should try Zach's perspective. It's pretty messed up. So, that's about it for today. It was a really short book review, but hey, what can I say? It was in a pinch. So, if you guys haven't noticed, there's Sebastian and there's Leo. You might remember them from one of my videos. They have a link there where you can go and subscribe. Why not go do that? Because I'm uh, pretty sure Leo likes people to subscribe. And Sebastian there, well, he's Sebastian. What can you do about him? I will see you guys probably next Wednesday with a different book, um, I'm probably going to focus on Darren Shan books, because I really like the author. So, why not go ahead and subscribe to me, just so you don't miss another book review, and why not tell me what I'm doing wrong, or what I'm doing good at. You know, I need some feedback, and you guys like to criticize, I like constructive criticism. So go ahead in the comments below, tell me what you like about it, tell me some books you might think I, you think I might like, or some you think I shouldn't read some you some genres you think I should read don't give me fucking Twilight I will hurt you don't give me fucking Fifty Shades of Grey I already have the goddamn collection don't give me that shit give me something good and it's worth my time you know guys alright I'll let you guys go remember down below 
Lynx, Vine, Instagram, Twitter, Book of Faces, fucking Tumblr, fucking subscribe because you know you want to. Deuces, remember, don't panic, always carry a towel.